Colorado Senate, Leland Vittert, what do you know? Uh, Michael Bennett wins re-election. So this is another one of the uh, far reaches uh, in, the, in the hopes and dreams of Republicans. Uh, and very early in the night, 20 minutes into polls being closed, uh, in Colorado, uh, we can project uh, Decision Desk HQ now projecting Michael Bennett is the winner over Joe O'Day. And he ran an interesting race, Chris. Yeah. Uh, he sort of tried to be this very centrist uh, Republican, uh, very moderate on the issue of abortion, squarely and only talked about inflation and economics. Um, if we were going to see sort of the, the outlier, the far, far outliers for the Republicans, uh, it was going to be this race. And it's not even close. Uh, the yeah, yeah, I got to tell you, Leland, I thought he distinguished himself that way also in the primary process. You know, not the most charismatic guy, um, uh, now Senator-elect Bennett, but he was a different kind of Democrat. And there was a reasonableness and an idea and a, dis a disgust that he had uh, for the kind of the, that, that feel, the pablum of partisanship uh, that I thought distinguished I, I, I covered Michael Bennett when I was a reporter in Denver, Colorado. He was the school board uh, right. guy. Uh, it ran the school board in Denver, uh, handpicked by uh, the other governor, or the other senator, uh, f former governor now uh, from Colorado. I, I think Michael Bennett uh, has sort of always been the dyed in the wool progressive. Uh, I I've never seen him be anything other than that. And really, if anything, he's brought Colorado, uh, he sort of outpaced Colorado to the left. And it's, it's certainly moved from a red state to a purple state to now, uh, if you look at this result, uh, certainly a, a, a decidedly blue state. Well, certainly in this race. Appreciate the perspective. Let's go to the panel. Johanna, you've got something you want to say? On Colorado, I actually think, like, it, being the head of school boards and in uh, public school districts is normally not something that you can run and win with massive popularity. So I think this actually shows that Bennett is a good candidate. He did try to run for president. Um, we'll have to see whether he's trying to run again. But I, I do think that um, Colorado is a sign that Democrats are doing some things differently. And actually, there is a really good House uh, race there, a congressional leader who's going to win, win her race, Brittany Peterson, Peterson who is um, this woman. She overcame her mother was uh, an addict. She, at the age of 12, was working. She was putting herself through school with the help of the public school system. She had teachers who helped her graduate from high school and college, something no one in her family had done. She went on to uh, be a community organizer, and she was actually very involved in the Obama orbit and has stayed involved in Colorado. So I think Colorado is actually a sign of some of the moderate um, policies that we do actually get right, and we expand our leads with moms of all different backgrounds, with people who are just wanting the government to work. Hey, thank you for watching. Please go to NewsNationNow.com, NewsNationNow.com, and you can find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button down below. Then you will get more of NewsNation's fact-driven coverage.